welcome to Ottawa. It's very bagpipey and dudes are singing. It's overly sunny. I'm not sure I'm a fan of that practically. And it comes with thick rocks, which I think is a nice touch. I was just saying the other day that real rocks are way too expensive to ship. So it's nice that they brought me some fake ones. Let's go see stuff. So there's been like a two day gap in the vlog and I'm sorry that's bad vlogmanship, but it's been nuts. Repo went really well. But it was uh, it was a mess. Literally everything that could go wrong technically went wrong. The lighting was all messed up. Like half of it was on the audio. It was bad. Uh, but it went really well. Other than that, I was really impressed. Uh, and then we did auditions, and that was fun and a little scary. The, it was yeah. The auditioning it's weird. Like it's fun, but it's always really daunting. It's I feel like there's way more responsibility when half my notes are like I like his hair and like. Wow, look at that outfit. Like, he's just random comments. But, uh, yeah, no, it's nuts. Um, yeah. This episode of Robin's Vlog is filmed in front of a live studio audience. Yay! What's the point of having family if you can't rope them into doing embarrassing things on the internet? Um, so, yeah, so I'm actually... What's really funny is my birthday was in, like, April, but my mom made me this really awesome collage collection of photos my entire life history up until now. Um, book... And uh, so we're going through that, we're just kind of reminiscing of all the crazy things Revan did, which is numerous, obviously. Um, but but the biggest, greatest one was this story about how when I was a kid, um, I was like four, and I, I was into Batman because my name is Robin, like that's a given. Um, and I got this motorcycle, like this Batman motorcycle, and I threw this fit because the Batman wouldn't come off, and they couldn't figure out why, and it's been this like family legend that four-year-old Robin lost it over the fact that Batman did not come off of the motorcycle. But what, I, what it turns out I never told them was the reason I was so upset was because I my favorite Batman was this purple suited one. It was the first one I got. I still have it. It's amazing. And uh, and I, when I was a kid, I didn't play Batman. I played Batman the TV show because I watched Batman the TV show, and they all looked like Batman the TV show. So what I was actually doing was making more episodes for it. So like I would save the backs of the the action figure cards and like hold them up for like commercial breaks, like. Da -na -na -na. But I'm like four-year-old Robin, so it's like even better. And so what I was really upset about was Batman didn't come off because the Batman on the bike was gray suited and the Batman in the scene before was purple suited and it didn't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I have Robin. been making films since before I understood the concept. I just loved the format. Took a train home, read Paper Towns. Very relaxing. I think the most zen part of my entire month was sitting on a train, reading Paper Towns, and just chilling out. It was good. Um, now I'm off to the museum. Very exciting. And then in the tomorrow, tomorrow, um, this will be up hopefully, and I will be filming a very special episode of the vlog at Fan Expo. Fan Expo! Uh, a lot of mess as to, you know, what costume I was gonna wear, but it's been decided via democracy. Via democracy? I've heard it both ways. Um, and yeah, it should be fun. Very exciting. I will let you guys know. And I don't have a question for you again this week because I suck and I've been too busy. You still have a week to put your questions in for Question Friday. That's next week. And other than that, please follow, you know, YouTube, Tumblr, Twitter, everything. Um, and I'll see you guys probably like in two days. <laughs>